Hello, today's video is on the process of terminating an employee in Google Apps. It's very important to have a process for when staff leave the business as you need to ensure that the right security measures are in place as well as not having to waste uh, money by renewing Google Apps accounts. We're going to cover three main points which is one resetting the user's password, resetting the sign in cookies and remotely wiping any mobile phones that they may have access to. First we need to log into the Google Apps control panel. Easiest way to do this is to log into Gmail with an administrator account. Click on settings, manage this domain. This brings up the Google Apps control panel. Once inside, you can then select users, find the user which you want to reset their password, and if you hover above their name, it will give you an option to reset the password. Otherwise, you can click on the user account to bring up the profile. And at the top, there's an option to reset password. Click on this link. And now you can enter in the new password. The new password needs to be complex with at least eight characters, including letters and numbers. Once entered, click reset password. Next, we're going to reset the user's sign-in cookies. To do this, go back to the user profile and click the link Reset Sign-in Cookies. This is important to do as it kicks the user out of any open sessions they may have in Gmail or Google Docs. Uh, if this isn't done, then the user can still access their email account even if the password has been reset if they have an open session in their browser. So make sure you click on this when resetting a password. The last step is to remotely wipe any Google Apps data that user may have on their mobile device or tablet. To do this, we go back into Users, Device Management, Manage Devices. This will display all the mobile devices the business has in Google Apps, receiving emails and Google Docs. Here you would select the particular phone. In this example, we don't have any phones configured. And then you'd choose the option to either remote wipe or wipe account. Remote wipe requires the Google Apps device policy installed on the phone. And that enables you to essentially factory reset the phone, removing all data, including pictures, emails, documents, basically all the data from the phone Otherwise, the option to wipe account will only remove the particular Google Apps email address or Google Drive profile from that phone, allowing the user to have all their existing emails still set up on that phone.